Hello internet world, welcome to a new video on the Geek Noise channel. Uh, whilst we're waiting for this particular live broadcast to start, I want to just welcome you all to the channel and welcome you to a new review as well. Uh, this is the IMU Ranger 2, uh, a very very good home security camera that connects either wirelessly or wired. Uh, and in fact, I've reviewed product from IMU before and I was very impressed with the quality uh, and I'm impressed with this one as well. Uh, now, this allows you to monitor your home in full HD, 1080p. It uses the H.265 codec as well, so very, very good codec, really good detail in the video. I'll show you the product very shortly. Uh, this obviously has got a picture of the product on the front. On the side, it shows you the app which you can use to uh, remotely access and view back your footage. And if you've got more than one camera, switch between cameras as well. As I mentioned before, it records in 1080p full HD. It does pan and tilt, human detection, two-way talk, uh, so two-way audio, uh, smart tracking. There's also a privacy mask as well, uh, Wi-Fi and a cloud service. Uh, round on the back here, details all of the connections and ports which I'm going to show you on the actual camera itself. Inside you obviously get the uh, cable to connect this to power. You also get a quick start guide. This is going to guide you through uh, the camera and getting everything up and running, uh, connecting it to the power adapter etc, connecting it to the app. Uh, you can also mount this upside down as well as stand it on a desk or table. We get a little piece of regulatory information, also a little feedback guide and the IMU website. Uh, this just asks you for some feedback and a great customer service anyway, nice little additional touch. Very small camera, as you can see, look at how small this is. Extremely small, very, very impressed with this. Uh, the base has obviously got some little tiny rubberized feet on. This is the camera section itself. And then we've also got speaker on the back, uh, just Underneath the camera lens, you can see a little tiny pinpoint microphone. Round on the back there, we've got the input for the power supply. It's micro USB, so if you want to use a longer cable, you can. Uh, also an ethernet uh, connection as well. So this connects via Wi-Fi, or indeed you can connect this uh, wired as well. So wired or wireless connection on this. Something else that's really nice is it does pan and tilt, so you can pan the camera around. Uh, you can also tilt it up and down. You can do this all through the app. This is motorized. If we look on the underside of this, we've got a little reset button, but we've also got, you can see just here, we've got a micro SD card slot. So you can use a micro SD card and actually then you've got the best of both worlds. This was the same with the other IMU camera that I uh, reviewed. You can actually record in the cloud of which you get seven days of recording and when you purchase one of their products, you get a 30 day free trial of that seven day recording history. Uh, from then on, you have to pay for a subscription service. It's very affordable. Uh, after uh, that runs out, of course, you've still got the local recording. So you record locally and in the cloud. So this has got the added advantage of if somebody steals your camera and you lose the micro SD card, then you've still got cloud recording. If the cloud recording goes down uh, and you've still got power going to the camera, of course, then you've still got the local recording. So best of both worlds. I'll talk to you about video quality in a short while. Uh, something else that people always mention to me is what if your internet goes down? What if your power goes down? Then these cameras are useless. Well, there is a solution to that. I might talk about it in more detail in a future video, but I use little UPS devices. So they're like big battery packs. Um, or, or bigger than like, you know, a power bank. It's like a bigger power bank with sockets on. So three pin UK sockets on the ones I use uh, or IEC connectors. And I actually use one for my computer as well. So if the power goes down, I've got about 20 to 30 minutes of use to, to shut down the computer properly. All of my security cameras are plugged into UPS devices as well, as is my internet. So if the mains power goes down, then I've still got roughly about an hour to an hour and a half of internet and an hour to an hour and a half of powering a couple of these cameras as well. So invest in the UPS if you're worried about uh, your home security cameras needing power all the time. Uh, so the design, first of all, it looks really cool. I think it's very, very neat, very cute design, uh, very functional design as well, very compact. So I like that this is nice and discreet, sitting on a shelf, you could get away with thinking this was just sort of some sort of air freshener or uh, a little tiny ornament. You could hide it behind some plants, for example. It looks cool. 
come on guys, admit it, it looks cool. With regards to the video footage, 1080p full HD, really nice colours and a really nice amount of detail. It also does people recognition, so you're going to get less false alarms. Uh, also, it records uh, when it's triggered by motion, it records the clip and then of course you can access that clip and download it to your computer or to your smartphone. It's got a really good app that runs alongside the cameras and I think the footage is just really nice and detailed. Where these uh, cameras from iMU Excel is in the affordability. They're very, very attainable, very affordable, and I've left links to where you can buy these for yourself down in the video description. I think they've got a good range of little cameras. I've got another review of another model coming up on the channel very soon, but please do check out the links down below to where you can pick this one up. I can highly recommend it because it does really good quality video footage and two-way audio uh, with a really good lens in a really neat little package. There's also a link down below to the IMU Life website, so please do check that out as well. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. Any questions or comments at all, then of course, pop them in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe because I publish a new tech video pretty much every single day. That's it for this video. I'll see you all in the next one.